Gotta try something new. Oh, yes! Look at this. Snap. So hello everybody, I am Checkpoint Professor. Today we're gonna be playing some of the hottest games on Game Builder Garage, as found on mygames.garage. It's the only place I know of to find a curated list of the hottest games of the week. So we'll just get started. But this is the first game we're gonna play. It's called Fish Drops the Base. No idea what it's gonna be about. Fish Drops the Base, here we go. Holy smokes. This sounds awesome, but I think, I think this is it. There's no gyroscopic controls. This is, this is one of the hottest games of the week, but it, it looks like a title screen for a game that somebody's making, which is, which is pretty common. So I even hit plus on it. Oh, you can see it does have some code to it. Okay, so what is it supposed to do? That's the question, let's see again. None of the controls do anything though. So, I give this game, I, I can't even give this game a grade. Um, it's not really a game. Once again, the hottest list of games has done me wrong. It showed me a stinker. So we're gonna move on, we're gonna move on. You never know what you're gonna get with the hottest games of the week, okay. All right, next one on the list is uh, Angry Birds. All right, we'll give it a go. All right, Angry Birds. This game is called Angry Birds. Oh, look at this, this is cool. So instead of you controlling the slingshot, it's just automatically firing and you can raise your oh you actually do oh fun okay so the the automatic firing of the bullets it just shows you the trajectory of the bird you're gonna flow throw so it seems more realistic so if we want to hit the pigs and then it pauses for a moment before it starts up again i'm not gonna this is actually a pretty awesome Recreation of Angry Birds. Notice the walls don't get destroyed, but I think they went with what they had. Let's see if we can... This is pretty fantastic. I failed. I failed, I didn't get the piggies. Let's try again. Let's see if we can do a better job. What a fun game. Okay, so I have four, five duckies. Gotcha, bro. And I'm not gonna win this one yet. Okay, so those ones do destroy, these pink ones don't. So here's my problem. I've only got one ducky left to get the piggies. And I'm not gonna do it. Okay, we failed again. This one is actually pretty awesome. I'm gonna try and I'm gonna try and beat it though. Okay, so what's the trick here, do you think? Let's try let's try hot some height. Okay, we got that. We got the far one. So I'm feeling pretty good about this. Let's see, how do we get... Okay, here we go. So we can get... I can get these two. Oh, no, that one's behind me. I can't get that one now. I'm hosed. Oh, what did that hit? I'm hosed. What did that hit? Ducky Momo. Dang it. Dang it. Okay, we can get that last one. Oh, we failed again. We're gonna do this. Gotta try something new. Oh, yes! Look at this. Snap. I bet there's another level. Three stars, baby. Three stars. Perfect score. Awesome. That was really cool. That was a fun game. I give that an A plus for Game Builder Garage Game. A pretty fantastic recreation of Angry Birds. So this one's called Baldi. All right, my friends, we're playing. What is this? Okay, this one's called Baldi. I'm not even sure what to do other than this. This character is coming after me, and I can grab him, and he hurts you. Okay. Okay. And there's a number. There's a counter. What am I supposed to do with this guy? You can go through these. Wait, what happened? Wait. don't know what to do. Trevor, thank you so much. What? This game is called Baldi. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna do an investigation here. Okay, so it says this is a remake of the original uh, Baldi Basic, an indie game from 2018. 
Has anyone heard of Baldi Basic? I haven't, so I don't know what to do. Other than it's a remake, no real instructions. So typically in a video game, you want to have some kind of introduction. You want to explain to the player what to do, right? So there's these letters. Wait, wait, what's this guy? What was that? What was that all about? Maybe someone in the chat has played Baldi's... Look, what is this one? Ryan Mountain says, yes, it's very well known. Okay, so that's the problem. It's not well known to me. Okay, what is this guy then? Okay. Baldi got me again. Come with me and you'll... Okay, there's a red one. Oh, wait. So... What's this? I have no idea how to play this game. And I'm not sure what that is. Okay, I left Baldi in there, I think. He's stuck. Okay, so I have freedom now. Okay, nothing in here. Trevor Burnt says, to be honest, I've never heard of Baldi either. So I was able to stick Baldi in a room. And somehow he got loose and, and found me. And I can't remember, can I push this gentleman? He is a little bit daunting, he's a giant of a man. We're just walking. Whoa, we smashed through. We smashed through the giant person. Okay. What's next, Baldi? Okay, the notebook should have math problems on them. If you click on them. <clears throat> so I can, I can grab the notebooks. And luckily, I got rid of Baldi. What? Look at this wall that fell down over here. What is this guy? Can I give him a notebook? Would you like a notebook, sir? No, he doesn't want a notebook. Okay, here's a table with another notebook. We'll take the blue one. And... You can't click on him. There are seven notebooks, I'm told. Well, what happened? What does the question mark do? Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. It looks like it has all the components of an educational Baldi game, but none of the working components. So we're gonna pass on this one. If anyone knows how to play Baldi's Revenge or Baldi's Basics, please let me know. So we're gonna play the next one. This is Wario Before Milk at 258. All right, this one's called Wario Before Milk at 3 a.m. Okay. So here is, what does that say, candy? Okay, candy. And I can't collect the candy, this looks creepy. Uh, for anyone hopping in, we're playing some Game Builder Garage games. This is Wario gets milk before 2.58 a.m. Kind of looks like, okay, big stairwell here. Let's take it down. The uh, music, it, what is this? Okay. It, it, Okay, there's my bed. Okay, the buttons don't do anything. Okay, so there is a bad guy down here. Okay, let's run for it. Let's run for it. Is it, can you hop down here? Is that Wario attacking me? Okay, according to, according to the internets, this is a sequel to the game Wario Gets Milk at 3am made by one and only hamburger who made Wario Steals Your Liver. Or PS5. Wario needs his milk and you are Waluigi. Be careful he doesn't get you. Sorry if the game is kind of short. So there's the candy. There's my bed, which, you know, makes sense. You just pass right through it. There's no collision. And you run downstairs and there is the sprite we're talking about. So I'm Waluigi and this is Wario. And he is going to get you. So how do I get milk? Is there an exit? There's no exit. So it is a very short game because, okay, you can only go down the stairs. He can't come up the stairs and there's no escape. So I understand the premise of this game. Once again, this is the hot, one of the hottest games of the week. I give this one a C minus. There's no objective as far as I can tell. So someone in the chat says I should just avoid Mario, which is cool. Or Wario, which is cool, but what to what end? I mean, I can continue to avoid War Wario. Do I get a reward for that? If you just kind of run around in circles, Wario doesn't get you, apparently. 
So you can kind of dance. You do this dance with Wario, and finally he gets you. All right, here we go. That is that that is it. It is what it is. So you check this one out. This is called Luigi Goes to Walmart. All right, here we go. Luigi Goes to Walmart. It's a side scroller. I love it. Yo, mom. All right, here we go. So this this. This is one of my annoyances of side scrollers where you just leave barely enough room for the player character. You can you can use you can use a little bit more space if you want to. Okay, so as far as I can tell, I can't pick up the be wait, oops, didn't mean to exit it. Here we go. Back into Lawaji goes to Walmart. I can't collect anything apparently. I can wall jump just like all of the other games. Hey, there's Mario. There's God. Oh my goodness. And there's a monster back there. Oh cool. Breakable floors. I like it. You reached Isle Infinity. What are these? These look like spikes, like I'm supposed to avoid them. There's the milk. Okay. The milk. The milk will kill you, my friends. Don't touch the milk. There's Isle Infinity. I'm assuming I'm supposed to jump over all this stuff then. Jump over the milk. This is creepy. He is tired, he is tired. Okay, and there's the end, my friends. Mad Mobster says I know this game. Okay, th this is it. Let's touch these things. Yep, they kill you. I thought they would. I was correct. Come up this way. Am I supposed to go down? Can I, do you think I can make it down through one of these? Can I wall jump up this? No. You cannot wall jump up it. Okay, that is it. I give this one a, a C plus. No collectibles, no core objectives that I can see other than to make it then. They don't even put like a, this is the end sign at the end of it. I'll tell you what, that little monster in the back of the aisles is crazy creepy though. So I give a bonus points for that. Okay, so that was uh, Luigi Goes to Walmart, my friends. All right, this has been uh, five of the hottest games of the week. If you like it, please subscribe, follow, do all that good stuff.